Hey guys, what's up? It's Greg. How's everybody doing today? Um, this is a review on the, um, 2004, uh, Spongebob the Squarepants movie. Um, I'm doing this as, a uh, kind of a warm-up, um, to the, um, n new movie that they expected, um, um, coming up next month, February 6th. Um, that movie will be entitled, um, The Sponge Out Water. And, uh, I did, I did a, I did a, an impressions video a while back, um, on my thoughts on it. It's called, um, Spongebob movie, uh, <coughs> 2015, so if you guys feel like it, feel free to check that out. Um, but this video is about, um, um, the, the, the first time ever that, uh, our little yellow friend and Patrick <laughs> ever had the chance to be on the big screen. So, here we go. Um, so the movie starts off with, um, Spongebob having this dream that, um, he's going to be mad manager of the new Krusty Krab, too. Because the crabs being the money, my hungry bottom feeder that he is, um, has come up with the idea that it, it, it's going to be more prop, a better way to make money if there's a second rusty grab. And SpongeBob always has wanted to be mad, you know, or like, he always took more pride in his work than Squidward does, so I guess, um, what, um, now, the, posi the position is, uh, Alright, right, about to be announced by the time the movie starts, so I guess prior to that, they want us to think that, um, the two of them know about the position for an extended amount of time, and Spongebob is sure he's going to get it, so, ironically, he keeps having dreams of that. Um, so anyway, um, Spongebob wakes up after that dream, and he tells Gary, Gary! I had that dream again. <laughs> um, and Gary goes, well. Um, so anyway, um, Spongebob runs out, runs out of the house like he always does. I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. <laughs> and then, uh, Patrick guy uh, comes up from under his rug and, um, asks Spongebob if, um, they're still going to, uh, give a good ice cream party boat tonight to celebrate his promotion. And, uh, Spongebob tells him, uh, look, man, I'm kind of worried I gotta get run rolling here. And Patrick just tells him, okay, buddy, see you later. And then, uh, when, uh, the ceremony happens, uh, Linda Krabs tells everybody that Squidward won and then, um, but right before Spongebob realizes this, he gets all happy and goes, Yeah, in your face. And then, um, when Mr. Krabs explains to Spongebob that he didn't get the job, uh, Spongebob gets all depressed. And then, um, um, now this, this to some people may have been the, uh, questionable part in the movie, um, where Spongebob and Patrick basically go on an ice cream binge, and then when Spongebob wakes up the next day, he almost looks like he's drunk, um, but, um, and then, uh, what we don't know, um, up until this point is, uh, Plankton to come up with an evil plan, uh, called Plan Z to finally get the Krabby Patty formula, and it, and it entails, uh, getting, um, the King of the Sea, Neptune's crown, um, so Plank did not doing magic to steal the crown, and he frames Mr. Krabs for doing it, um, so N Neptune eventually arrives at the Krusty Krab, and accuses Mr. Krabs of stealing the crown, and Mr. Krabs is like, I didn't do it, I didn't do it, but, ne but King Neptune doesn't believe Mr. Krabs, and he, uh, freezes Mr. Krabs, uh, puts him on ice, rather, and then, uh, Spongebob, uh, basically offers, um, to, 
to go and to go and get Neptune's crown, which is in this place called Shell City, which is sort of like a forbidden city, and no one's ever made it there. But SpongeBob and Patrick still offer to try. Ne Neptune agrees to let him try, but they eventually come to the agreement that he has to do it within six days. Or um, the crabs is uh, basically Gonzo, um, meaning Neptune's going to do away with them. Um, so uh, Pat Patrick and SpongeBob basically go on this journey where they have to uh, fight off all these monsters, uh, bad guys at clubs, and the only person that seems to believe in uh, Patrick and SpongeBob is a. Uh, um, King Neptune's daughter Mindy, in fact, um, she eventually, uh, gives them away to get themselves back home to Bikini Bottom, but Spongebob and Patrick accidentally release the magic bag of winds that was supposed to get them back home, so how they end up getting home is actually really cool. Um, they ride on David Asselhoff, yes, I mean the actor. <laughs> Um, but something really, uh, interesting and moving before that, I think, is, um, Patrick and Spongebob end up getting captured by this diver. Well, in the movie, it's called a Cyclops, but it actually is a diver, and that's sort of what makes the, uh, Shell City forbidden. Oh, and we actually find out towards the end of the movie that Shell City is not a city at all. It's in fact a gift shop. Um, so yeah. Anyway, uh, Spongebob and Patrick get captured and tried to be sell sold as merchandise. And the, the heat from being under the land causes them to die. Um, but until the sprinklers go off and they magically come back to life. Anyway, to wrap the movie up. Um, Spongebob and Patrick give them to this brown bag and free Mr. Krabs. So, yeah, anyway, guys, overall, great, great, great movie if you're a Spongebob fan like I am. And, uh, I, I honestly can't wait to see the sponge out of water. It was really cool, and yeah, um, that's about it for this one, guys. So, feel free to subscribe, 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 and keep on rocking, yeah.